out to my channel if this is your first time of coming to my channel thanks a lot don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like share and subscribe in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys businesses that you can start with no capital at all and even though you need capital you just need hundred dollars so these are jobs or businesses that you can do with little or no capital and the maximum money you need for some of these businesses is just hundred dollars and i'm also going to highlight the ones that you need no capital at all and the ones that you need hundred dollars at the capital to start now also note that if you are looking out to start like a business or a side hustle, this is one video that you should watch to the end the first business i'm going to say is job shipping you guys don't know how much a drop shipper is actually making who is a drop shipper this is somebody who creates an account it could be on instagram it could be on facebook or your whatsapp creates an account and you keep on posting pictures now a drop shipper is basically an intermediary between the seller and the consumer what you are going to do is you have an instagram account you just post pictures of bags as an example you keep on posting pictures you have sellers of bags that gives you their pictures to post once you have order you go to the seller pick up the bag at a discounted price at an wholesale price and then you give it to your customer by this you are making your profits without buying the bag down so you don't have the item down you are basically just advertising the item using the pictures or the details of the seller and once you have an order you move the goods from the seller's place to the consumer's place without adding any capital to this so this is one business that you can start without any capital at all and trust me you are going to make money from it so go into this if you are interested use like a social media platform it could be your whatsapp it could be facebook or instagram just post pictures and once an order come up you pick it up from the seller and you send it to the customer and you get your own profit it is so easy now another one again that you need no capital at all is to be a content creator you have a smartphone use your smartphone it could be posting videos on instagram news it could be posting videos on tiktok it could be facebook it could be creating a youtube channel you know you have your smartphone all you have to do is to create content all you have to do is to post pictures all you have to do is just to use your phone to create content and to post pictures on any social media platform and you can start any for me you can have brands that can reach out to you to say can you advertise this product for me on my behalf you can have people to say they want to feature in your, in your, in your videos these are also ways in which you can earn money you can start up little comedy or little kids you know just start acting something very little if you have this acting skill if you are a very funny person you can start you know little comedy shows with your smartphone and from there you are going to make money it is so easy you don't need any capital to start this you have your phone Start with your phone and when you grow, you can start adding so many gadgets as possible. And another one that you need no capital at all is to teach a skill. Teaching a skill, you can teach a skill. It could be how to cook, it could be how to make hair, it could be how to sew a clothes, it could be how to read faster. There are so many skills you can teach people. There are so many knowledge you have that you can teach people and you are going to earn from it. Teaching could be physically, it could also be online teaching. You have a smartphone. Make a flyer, make a post. Hi guys, I'm going to teach you guys how to make your hair. You don't need any skill for that. You don't need any capital for that. All you need rather is just your skill. You don't need any capital. You can teach skills. I am going to make money from it. By the time you teach one or two people, they keep on referring people to you. And from there, your business is going to grow. So you can teach a free course. You can offer courses to people. You know, your, your services or your courses could be either digital or handmade. Teach a skill. It is an easier way for you to make money but the only thing is that you cannot teach when you don't have you have to equip yourself in order for you to be able to teach people okay but starting up a a course you need 
no money all you need is just your smartphone and then you start teaching people the other one again that i'm going to say is that you can be a personal shopper so a personal shopper can be locally or personal shoppers can be done internationally so personal shoppers locally can be you know you offer services like going to the market to buy things for people especially for those people that have like nine to five they're actually very busy they don't want to go to the market they don't want to search for things you can start up a a personal shopper business you help people to shop locally could be going to the market to buy things for people and internationally could be shopping for people on international websites like zara h and m and all of that so personal shopper this is one skill also or one business that you can start without any capital at all all you have to do is to be available to help people to source for the products source for what they want to buy buy it and give it to them you don't need any capital to start this business you just have to be willing to be able to go to the market or go to the site and shop for them another thing i'm going to say about personal shopper is the fact that you should also have taste you know taste of the kind of dresses that people want you should be able to listen to people and buy exactly what they want and be able to communicate with them carry them along on your way to the market carry them give them every details that they need to know about a particular product or services and then you are going to make your money it is very easy you can even do it in a very big way you know by setting up like a professional page as a personal shopper on instagram by this people are going to reach out to you because nobody wants to go through the stress of buying things like people want somebody that can go to that stress buy it and deliver it to them at their door post with this you don't need any capital at all and you're also going to make your money business also that requires no capital at all is a cleaning business yes cleaning business all you have to do is to buy your mop your broom your bucket these things are actually very cheap you are definitely not going to spend your hundred dollars on broom and mop and you start up cleaning services you can start by Telling your friends and your family that you are available for clean up, you can clean up their houses, you can clean up their cars, you know, you are available for cleaning services, you can have like a page where you advertise your cleaning services to people, and once they reach out to you, you have your buckets, you have milk, you have a broom. You are not spending up to hundred dollars on this. The only thing you might need to buy is just your cleaning material, which is like your um, disinfectant or disinfectant or the liquid soap or whatever you are going to use and trust me you won't be spending up to hundred dollars to buy this thing so this is something that is very easy and very cheap to venture into and you are going to make your money you, do you know how much people pay for someone to wash their cars or for someone to clean their whole building for them people are looking out for someone that can come into their house on weekend and clean up the place they don't have to go through that stress of having to clean up or to wash dishes or to take care of the laundry so this is one business you should go into if you love washing if you love cleaning up then you should go into this you are not spending up to hundred dollars at all Pick up that broom in your house. Pick up that bucket in your house. Get out. Go. Go and clean up. Okay. Now what I'm going to say is write a blog. Writing a blog, you know, you need no capital to write a blog. All you are just doing is just to write. And as long as you can read and write, you should be able to create a blog. All you have to do is to create a blog post, a blog page, which is actually very easy and cheap. Create a blog page and then you start writing. You can write about anything you love. It could be cooking, it could be making of hair, it could be tailoring, it could be digital skills. You can just take out your time to write. So writing is another skill that you need no capital to start. Aside writing from blogs, you can also be a translator. So let's say you understand English. There are people who are looking out for someone who can translate English to their local languages, you know. There are someone who is looking out for who can translate their local language to English or French to English or French to Yoruba or English. Like there are so many people that are looking out for people who can translate a certain language to another language, and I'm sure that everyone understands two languages. So the two languages that I'm talking about could be like your dialect 
or your own town languages. There are people who are looking out for people who can translate for them. So if you don't want to write a blog, you can pick up a translating job and translate for people. This also has to do with writing skills and you are not spending any money at all to be a blog writer to translate for people you are not spending any money at all so please go into this if you love writing if you love the ability to, if you have the ability to write or to translate this is one business that you should also venture into so i think i've mentioned about five to six businesses that don't require any capital at all all okay i said you can drop ship you can write a blog you can be a content creator you can start up a cleaning business um be a personal shopper so i've mentioned like five businesses that don't need any capital at all in order for you to achieve it now let me list some business that you can start with little capital and the maximum of capital you might have to spend will just be hundred dollars number one thrift business thrifting is all money business you can thrift clothes you can thrift wigs you can thrift shoes you can thrift bags you can thrift furnitures there are people who sell thrifted furnitures you can thrift kitchen utensils or kitchen materials there are people who sell thrifted kitchen ways there are people who sell thrifted furniture thrifted clothes thrifted glasses this is something that people want to buy because it's going to be cheaper than the new one and everybody is looking out for ways in which they can save money and still achieve a particular product so go into thrifting business this is one business that you don't need so much capital to start if you want like the regular one which is like clothes shoes and bags you can just buy like a bill of clothes now when it comes to clothes you have to be intentional about what sector of clothing do i want to go into is it treated for is it treated there for children is it treated there for women is it treated there for office wear is it treated high heels is it treated shoes is it treated on this you have to be able to know like the niche in which you want to choose for so once you know the niche all you have to do is to go to like where they sell thrifted bill and then you buy the bill iron it if you are going to close you have to package it packaging is another means to make money package your business nobody is going to package it like you package your business package yourself you want to go into thrifting business get the thrifted clothes iron it wash it put it, put it on on the mannequin display it people are going to buy it you can sell it times two of the initial price you bought it and nobody's going to know nobody is going to know that is a thrifted clothes <laughs> nobody is going to know that is a thrifted shoe you have to be able to package it and if you want to start up a thrifting business you don't need up to hundred dollars to start you can just start with few samples iron it put, put it on display it on a mannequin you can put it on you can post it on your social media and just if you have social media pages like your whatsapp your facebook your instagram and you are not making use of it then you are not ready to start up a business because the contact that you have on your whatsapp is enough for you to actually sell out if you are making good use of it so when you start up your thrifting business you can post it on your whatsapp post it on your instagram post it on your facebook people are going to patronize you and with that you can start any money from me then the more money you earn the more you increase the amount of bill you buy so thrift business is one business that you can go into it could be thrifted kitchen wares. it could be thrifted microwave a cheaper one you buy it from somebody that wants to sell and then you resell it you are going to make your money there's someone who wants to sell out their microwave for an example they are relocating or they, they bought a new microwave you can buy the microwave, clean it up, repaint it, make sure it's working well, and then you will sell it. That process of doing that, you earn your money without putting any money into it. 
Street business is like oil making money business. Number one that requires little capital, which you are not going to be spending up to hundred dollars, is juice business. Everybody wants to drink juice. Juice could be locally made juice in Nigeria. It could be zobo. It could be kunu. It could be apple juice. It could be pineapple juice. All you have to do is to buy the fruits. Now, when you want to source for the fruits, you go to where they sell fruits in bulk, like wholesale fruits, the market or the store where you can get like your like your juice in bulk. You buy it. The only thing you need to invest into is a juice making machine. And trust me, your juice making machine is not going to cost hundred dollars. Okay, you get a juice um making machine or a blender that can bring out your juice from it and then you blend it you get this um, plastic bottles you put it inside and then you label it and you sell everybody wants to buy juice your juice could be locally made like i said it could be this parfait parfait juice it could be apple juice people are going to love this as long as you are giving people quality for their money so this is something you should also venture into you can sell it on your WhatsApp and also you can sell it around within your neighborhood so for this food business you might not necessarily you know, be outside in terms of social media you can sell it for people in your office people that work in your environment people are going to buy it from you because everybody loves to take fruits another business that people don't talk about is recycling business <laughs> recycling business so you can pick up these pet bottles and then you recycle it and then you sell it to the companies that are in charge of recycling so in nigeria for example there are people who have like this um, plastic bottles you can just pick it up from them and you can pay someone to pick up like um pet bottles around you buy them and then you sell it to the recycling company so with this you don't need up to hundred dollars to recycle pet bottles go to where they sell pet bottles you buy them and then you sell it to the recycling company you don't need a hundred dollars to start this business so recycling business is one business you should go into and venture into that you are going to make your money from without breaking the bank you don't need up to hundred dollars to go into your recycling business and trust me you are also going to make profit from it so this is one business that i think you should venture into another business that you don't need up to hundred dollars to start is delivery business delivery business you really don't need hundred dollars to start with delivery business now delivery business could be delivery business could be done either locally or internationally it all depends on the level at which you want to start your delivery business your delivery business as an example here in europe you just need like your bicycle and bicycle doesn't cost up to that it's just like a bicycle in terms of bicycle it could be a manual bicycle or electric bicycle it all depends on your budget and then like i said you are buying a thrifted bicycle not a new one you get a thrifted bicycle and then you go around and you deliver things to people okay in nigeria for an example there are people who give out their their okadas their bikes um their bikes their bicycle on higher purchase so we don't, really don't need to buy the bicycle for you to start we don't need to buy the vehicle for you to start you can get like the bicycle from people who give out on higher purchase where you are going to be paying weekly so from the delivery business that you make from delivering products to people you are going to get your own profit and also the money to pay for the higher purchase of the bicycle so with this you really don't need up to an hundred dollars for you to start all you need is just to create awareness that you're actually you know, running a delivery business and also you have to have integrity of not stealing or running away with people's item once you're able to build that integrity of being faithful you don't steal you don't run away with people's item people are going to trust you to deliver millions of goods to people now one advantage of also this delivery business is the fact that you can also get tips from people so when delivering an item some people might offer to give you tips so this can also cover up for your side as well or this can also cover up for an extra income now another business that doesn't need up to an hundred dollars to start is weed making and daily 
wig making when you go into wig making business this is one business that you don't really need much the only thing you are going to venture into or the only thing you are going to spend your money into is just to learn how to make wigs so and learning how to make wigs you might get someone who will teach you how to make wigs without spending up to an hundred dollars to learn so if you are able to get that and then you have mediums like youtube where you can learn more and develop yourself more once you're a wig maker or a game maker you really don't need a hundred dollars to start up your business all you need is probably if you make your wigs with your hands all you need is just like needle and thread which is less than one dollar and if you want to go like an advanced way all you need is to get a tabletop mini machine and for that you can shop for a thrifted sewing mini machine that is what you need and thrifted sewing mini machine might not be up to hundred dollars and the only thing you need for a wig business is just your thread your needle and also your cap which is not up to hundred dollars in nigeria for example you can go into daily making what is daily making that is making um hair wraps for people hair wraps for people for so you make hair wraps for people you are not spending up to hundred dollars because you just help them to tie their gear or to tie their hair wraps and especially like during the weekends from thursdays to sundays you are going to make a lot of money because you are just helping people to tie so you can look out for where they have events around your area and just i'm going to say hi i do makeup i do gaming i can do like your makeup and tie your hair wrap for you and people are going to patronize you with that you really don't need up to an hundred dollars to start i hope this video has been able to enlighten you if you are looking out for a side or to start a business you can start with little or no capital have been able to drop examples of business you can venture into let me know what topic you want me to make a video on in the comment section if you have any question please go ahead and put it down in the comment section thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next one bye